Resilience isn't just a response to hardship, it's a learned skill that strengthens us to navigate life's challenges with calm and purpose. Throughout history, resilience has been revered as essential for personal growth. As Winston Churchill famously said, success is not final, failure is not fatal, it is the courage to continue that counts. This guide distills powerful, research-backed strategies to help build resilience in everyday life. Drawing insights from psychology, philosophy, and science, it offers tools like cognitive reframing, mindfulness, self-compassion, and goal-setting, all aimed at nurturing resilience as an active skill. Ancient Stoic wisdom echoes this, as Marcus Aurelius advised, the impediment to action advances action. What stands in the way becomes the way. These words resonate with our ability to turn setbacks into opportunities for growth. By practicing skills like emotional awareness, building supportive relationships, and engaging in physical activity, resilience becomes an accessible and transformative practice for anyone. Prepare to discover how small, consistent actions can empower you to face life's challenges with strength and adaptability. Understand resilience as a skill. Resilience defined as the capacity to adapt positively and recover from adversity, is not simply an inborn trait but a skill anyone can develop. Resilience is essential for managing stress and maintaining mental health over the long term. The American Psychological Association APA, views resilience as crucial for emotional well-being emphasizing that it is learned and strengthened through experience. Studies by researchers like Dr. and Mastin refer to it as ordinary magic due to its universal, adaptable nature. To foster resilience, start by viewing it as a skill like any other, needing consistent practice. Key approaches include facing difficulties with a proactive mindset, cultivating patience, and gradually building one's tolerance for frustration. According to Dr. Mastin, resilient individuals often thrive because they practice everyday habits that reinforce their mental flexibility, such as problem-solving and seeking support when needed. Remember, resilience isn't about eliminating challenges or escaping stress, but rather navigating them effectively. You can enhance this skill by identifying small daily actions that help you adapt to unexpected changes or stress. This perspective shift from seeing resilience as a fixed quality to understanding it as a skill underlines that improvement is possible for everyone, at any age. By recognizing resilience as both attainable and essential, one gains motivation to develop it intentionally, making it part of everyday responses and mindsets. Develop a Growth Mindset A growth mindset, a concept popularized by psychologist Carol Dweck, is foundational to resilience. Those with a growth mindset believe abilities and intelligence can be developed through effort, effective strategies, and support. This outlook fosters resilience because it encourages learning from setbacks and viewing challenges as opportunities. Dweck's research on mindset found that people who believe in their potential for improvement tend to persevere in the face of adversity. Developing this mindset involves actively reframing challenges, 
recognizing that mistakes are not signs of failure but steps toward growth. For instance, if you struggle with a task, rather than labeling it as a personal failure, view it as a skill that can be improved. Begin by identifying specific areas in which you feel challenged and commit to learning strategies to address them. Recognizing that growth takes time, set incremental goals to see progress without expecting overnight success. This approach makes resilience a byproduct of curiosity and persistence rather than a daunting test of will. Embrace feedback, seeing it as a tool to help you grow, not as criticism. Adopting a growth mindset transforms adversity into a learning process, helping to lower stress and maintain motivation. By fostering the belief that you can change, you'll build resilience naturally, handling setbacks with a productive, positive attitude. If you're enjoying this audiobook and finding value in the content, we kindly ask you to take a moment to subscribe to the channel. A large portion of our listeners and viewers haven't subscribed yet, and by doing so, you'll help us grow and continue bringing you more high-quality audiobooks. Your support means a lot to us, and it's just one click away. So, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to stay connected and never miss out on our latest releases. Set realistic goals and break them down. Setting achievable goals and breaking them down into manageable steps strengthens resilience by reducing overwhelm and promoting progress. Psychology suggests that achievable, Clear goals enable people to stay motivated, especially during challenging times. Goal Setting Theory, championed by Dr. Edwin Locke and Dr. Gary Latham, shows that specific and realistic goals foster focus and persistence. Begin by identifying what you want to accomplish ensuring it's both meaningful and feasible given your current resources and limitations. Break this goal into smaller tasks that feel manageable. Each completed step serves as a mini milestone, providing a sense of accomplishment and momentum. For instance, if your goal is to improve your physical health, Rather than aiming to exercise for an hour every day immediately, start with 10 minutes, gradually increasing as it becomes routine. This structured approach creates a pathway to success that feels achievable, helping reduce stress and anxiety. Each small win contributes to a sense of control and reinforces your commitment qualities that are foundational to resilience. Keeping track of your progress through a journal or app can further solidify motivation and highlight growth. When setbacks occur, recognize that minor adjustments to your steps are part of the journey. By structuring your goals with realistic, clear steps, you create an adaptable plan that builds resilience while making larger challenges feel manageable. Practice Mindfulness Meditation Mindfulness meditation, which involves focusing on the present moment without judgment, has been shown to improve resilience by enhancing emotional regulation and stress tolerance. Research by Dr. John Kabat-Zinn and others highlights that mindfulness practices reduce anxiety and increase overall well-being, making individuals better equipped to handle adversity. Meditation trains the mind to observe thoughts and feelings without immediate reaction, fostering an attitude of calm and acceptance. 
to incorporate mindfulness, start with short daily sessions, such as focusing on your breathing for 5 minutes each morning. Gradually extend the time as you become more comfortable with the practice. This consistency strengthens your ability to maintain focus, an essential skill when navigating life's inevitable stressors. Mindfulness also helps create mental space to observe and manage emotions, rather than being overwhelmed by them. Dr. Kabat-Zinn's research on mindfulness-based stress reduction MBSR, has shown it to be effective in reducing symptoms of depression, anxiety, and chronic stress. Mindfulness can also be integrated into daily activities, like walking or eating, by paying full attention to the experience. This habit helps build resilience by grounding you in the present, reducing anxiety about the past or future. With continued practice, mindfulness meditation cultivates a calmer mind, enabling you to face daily challenges with increased resilience and composure. Build Self-Compassion Self-compassion involves treating yourself with the same kindness and understanding you would offer a friend, particularly in times of struggle. According to Dr. Kristen Neff, a leading researcher in self-compassion, this practice reduces self-criticism, fosters emotional resilience, and supports mental well-being. Self-compassion is especially useful for resilience because it softens the impact of failure and setbacks, allowing you to recover with less emotional turmoil. To develop self-compassion, start by noticing your inner self-talk, especially in challenging moments. Replace harsh or critical statements with gentle encouragement and understanding. Neff's research outlines three components of self-compassion, self-kindness, common humanity, and mindfulness. Self-kindness involves being supportive rather than judgmental toward oneself. Common humanity reminds you that difficulties are a universal experience, helping you feel connected rather than isolated. Mindfulness and self-compassion involves observing your emotions without over-identifying with them. Practicing self-compassion also involves acknowledging imperfections without letting them define your self-worth. Simple exercises, such as writing supportive messages to yourself or speaking encouragingly during a setback, strengthen self-compassion over time. This approach builds resilience by promoting a kind inner narrative, making it easier to cope with setbacks and maintain motivation for improvement. Self-compassion allows you to face challenges with a positive, nurturing perspective, essential for sustaining resilience in everyday life. Strength and Emotional Awareness Emotional awareness is the skill of recognizing and understanding your emotions and how they influence your thoughts and actions. Building this skill is key to resilience, as it enables you to manage reactions to stressors more effectively. Emotional intelligence, a concept developed by psychologists Peter Salovey and John Mayer and popularized by Daniel Goleman, includes emotional awareness as its foundation. To develop this awareness, start by regularly observing and labeling your emotions without judgment, such as noting when you feel anxious, frustrated, or content. This process is known as effect labeling and helps distance you from intense feelings, making them easier to manage. 
techniques such as journaling or conducting brief emotion check-ins throughout the day can also boost awareness, allowing you to recognize patterns in your responses to stress. Studies suggest that high emotional awareness helps individuals stay composed in challenging situations, strengthening resilience by reducing impulsive reactions. Developing this skill not only enhances personal resilience but also improves relationships, as it promotes empathy and reduces misunderstandings. Emotional awareness also aids in problem solving by allowing you to identify how your emotions impact decision making. Over time, Cultivating emotional awareness transforms how you handle adversity, helping you remain grounded, thoughtful, and adaptable. This skill is essential for maintaining resilience in everyday life, as it fosters a balanced approach to emotional highs and lows, making challenges feel more manageable. Engage in physical activity. Physical activity is a practical, science-backed approach to building resilience by enhancing both mental and physical well-being. Research in exercise psychology shows that regular physical activity helps reduce stress and anxiety, releasing endorphins that boost mood and increase emotional resilience. Dr. Kelly McGonigal a health psychologist, emphasizes exercise's profound impact on brain chemistry, as it promotes the growth of new neurons, particularly in areas associated with stress regulation, such as the hippocampus. Engaging in even moderate physical activity, such as brisk walking, yoga, or cycling, can have profound effects on mood helping buffer against everyday stress. To make physical activity a sustainable part of resilience building, start with a manageable routine that suits your lifestyle and gradually increase intensity as it becomes a habit. Simple steps like taking the stairs, stretching during breaks, or adding brief walks can make a difference. Additionally, exercises that combine physical movement with mindfulness, such as yoga or tai chi, offer added benefits by teaching mental focus and relaxation. Regular physical activity provides a reliable outlet for managing stress, helping you maintain composure and perspective in difficult situations. It can also improve sleep, which further enhances resilience by supporting mental clarity and energy levels. Over time, consistent exercise strengthens the body's and mind's resilience, enabling you to better cope with life's challenges. Nurture Supportive Relationships Supportive relationships are a cornerstone of resilience providing emotional and practical support that makes challenges more manageable. Social support theory suggests that individuals with strong social networks experience less stress and recover faster from adversity. This perspective is supported by researchers such as Dr. Sheldon Cohen who found that people with meaningful relationships have better immune responses and greater mental health resilience. To cultivate this support, prioritize time with family, friends, and communities where you feel accepted and understood. Actively engaging with others fosters a sense of belonging reducing feelings of isolation that can amplify stress. Building supportive relationships also involves open communication, empathy, and reciprocation, as relationships are strengthened when both parties feel valued. 
In times of stress, reaching out to trusted individuals can offer new perspectives, practical solutions, and emotional comfort. Even digital connections can provide valuable support when face-to-face -face interaction isn't possible. Additionally, strong social ties encourage positive behaviors, such as regular exercise and stress management practices, which reinforce resilience. Participating in supportive communities, whether through clubs, groups, or online forums, can also build a sense of collective resilience, where challenges are shared and normalized. Embracing and nurturing supportive relationships helps create a reliable, uplifting network that strengthens your ability to handle life's ups and downs. Practice Cognitive Reframing Cognitive Reframing a technique rooted in cognitive behavioral therapy CBT, involves changing the way you perceive stressful situations to reduce their emotional impact. Developed by Dr. Aaron Beck, CBT emphasizes that our thoughts influence our feelings and actions. By reframing negative thoughts, we can manage our responses to stress more effectively. Practicing cognitive reframing begins with identifying automatic negative thoughts, such as I always fail or this will never work, and replacing them with more constructive alternatives, like I can try again or this is an opportunity to learn. This exercise shifts your mindset reducing feelings of helplessness and promoting resilience by fostering a more balanced, realistic perspective. When faced with challenges, ask yourself questions to explore other possible viewpoints. Is there another way to see this? Or what can I learn from this experience? Cognitive reframing empowers you to interpret situations in ways that reduce stress, transforming obstacles into manageable problems rather than insurmountable ones. Research shows that individuals who regularly practice reframing experience lower levels of anxiety and greater adaptability, essential qualities of resilience. Over time, this skill becomes a natural response to setbacks, strengthening your ability to maintain focus and motivation in adversity. Practicing cognitive reframing enables a resilient, optimistic approach to life's challenges, helping you move forward constructively. Embrace Stoic Philosophy Principles Stoic philosophy offers timeless techniques for resilience by teaching us to focus on what we can control and accept what we cannot. Ancient Stoic thinkers like Marcus Aurelius, Epictetus, and Seneca emphasized resilience as a product of inner strength and rational thought. A key Stoic practice is to differentiate between what is within our control, our thoughts and actions, and what is not, external events and others' actions. By focusing on controllable factors, we can navigate challenges with a sense of calm and purpose. For example, when faced with a setback, instead of fixating on the outcome, Focus on how you can respond constructively. Practicing gratitude, another stoic technique, involves recognizing positives in every situation, fostering a resilient mindset. The stoics also practiced premeditatio malorum, or the premeditation of evils where they visualized potential challenges to mentally prepare themselves for adversity. This practice strengthens resilience by reducing the fear of the unknown and enabling calm, rational responses. 
modern proponents of Stoicism, like Dr. William Irvine, emphasize its practical applications for maintaining composure. Embracing Stoic principles develops a proactive, adaptive mindset that fosters resilience by teaching acceptance, self-control, and focus, regardless of circumstances. Reflect and learn from setbacks. Reflection and learning from setbacks are essential practices for building resilience as they promote growth and continuous improvement. Reflective practices, supported by positive psychology, encourage looking back on challenging experiences to identify valuable lessons. To begin, regularly take time to reflect on what went well, what didn't, and what can be done differently in future situations. This can be achieved through journaling, where you explore setbacks objectively without self-blame, or by discussing experiences with a mentor or friend who offers constructive feedback. Dr. Carol Dweck's research on a growth mindset aligns closely with reflective practices, as it views setbacks as opportunities for learning and adaptation rather than as failures. Reflection helps in identifying patterns and behaviors that either contribute to or hinder resilience, allowing you to make conscious adjustments. This process of continuous self-assessment not only enhances self-awareness but also builds confidence in your ability to handle similar situations in the future. Over time, reflection strengthens a proactive, solution-oriented mindset essential for resilience, as it transforms adversity into a stepping stone for personal growth. Reflecting on past setbacks ultimately empowers you to handle future challenges with a calm, informed, and resilient approach, fostering steady improvement in life's demanding situations. Copyright 2024 by Audiobooks Tube. Thank you for listening. Please consider to subscribe, like, and share to help the channel growth new videos on a daily basis.